Thank you for joining me today. My name is Noel Mosley. I am with the MSX Group, and this recording is a general overview of Microsoft Forecaster 7.0. Microsoft Forecaster is a budgeting, forecasting, and planning application. It offers spreadsheet-style user interface. There's built-in security and workflow. There's instant consolidation for reporting inside the application. Budgeting is done at the individual account level, or there's also detail areas for capital, budgeting for new assets, revenue, or human resources. And users may access the budget either directly through the application or via web access. Let's switch over to the application now. First area I want to show us is the data input section inside Forecaster. Forecaster will open up the input screen for whatever center or department we want to budget for. The first page that comes up is the multi-row, the individual account level input screens. This page here are either calculations or they're coming from other detail sections in Forecaster or other data inputs. We also have a tab at the top for single row. Single row allows us to budget for the individual accounts but we get to compare it to a baseline if you want to. Uh, baseline might be actuals, might be last year's budget, might be last year's forecast. And we can then budget by change, dollar change or percent changes. We have a tab at the top for human resources. This will let us budget for individual employees and for new hires. And forecast will calculate the wages, taxes, and benefits for these uh, individual people. Capital detail inside Forecaster will let us budget for new assets, and this will then book the cost to the cost account and depreciation expense to the appropriate account. And then revenue detail, we have an option breaking down revenue detail against market and product, although the terminology might be changed to represent something else. And then we track whatever stats or other accounts that we want to make up uh, to use the calculations for revenue and revenue related accounts. Let me show you the budgeting reporting section next. I'll go to build reports. And under income statements, I'll just run this one for the budgeted income statement. Forecaster allows us to report off the data that's inside the Microsoft Forecaster database. This is either data that we've entered through input or we might have imported this, these balances from other external sources. Consolidation is handled by roll-up definitions inside Forecaster. If you're running reports for a consolidated, consolidated level, there is drill down. If I wanted to see what makes up this row for exempt uh, labor, double-click anywhere on this row. Forecaster will drill down. Uh, and I can continue to drill down until I get to the lowest level in these roll-up reports. Once I get past the individual account, I can then drill into the detail area. And forecasts are showing the individual employees that make up the total for that report. I want to mention security inside Forecaster. If I go to Setup and Security. We organize our users by groups inside Forecaster. I've got two users here as under Analyst. And under this Business Analyst 2, if I expand that, I can see the individual departments that have been assigned to this individual for, for this user. That makes sure we keep track of who assigned, who is assigned to whose budget, who has access for reporting and for input. There's a lot of other application and uh, functionality inside Forecaster, but those are the big pictures, data input, re uh, reporting, and security. Uh, let me also mention workflow. Workflow lets you have uh, a record or a way to keep track of who is assigned to what budget, what cost center's budgets, and what's the status of their budget. Is it in progress? Have they submitted it? Has it been approved or rejected? Now this is a quick overview of the application, but I want to mention if you need additional information, we have our, our website at msxgroup.com. 
We have uh, email for info at msxgroup.com as well. We have an account on Twitter, which is MSX Group. On LinkedIn.com, we have a group for Microsoft Forecaster users. And feel free to email me at noah.mosley at msxgroup.com. Thank you for joining me. Have a great day.